do we think the bomb is at? 413. 55. Oh. 54. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. 53. Wait. 52. 51. Aren't you curious? 50. 49. Right? 48. <laughs> yeah, 47, okay, fair enough. 46. Okay, well, let's 45. Look around, I guess. Yeah, here, let me let me let me let me read let me read this to you while we're so there's a, a, a letter at the beginning of the Inflight magazine from the Alvinist. Forty. Thirty-nine. And here he says, uh, "I am an old man, and the Starship Titanic is my masterwork, the true enduring achievement of my life. She is more than just the most fabulous luxury starship ever conceived. She is embodied at her very core in titanium." A living web of complex, 30, sensitive, preemptive, emotelligent control systems. To me, she is literally alive. 26, 25, 24. By the time you read this, friends, Titania will be ready to ascend into the firmament in all her glory. I wish you joy of her. For me, triumph will be tinged with sadness, as I shall be saying farewell to my starship, my Titania, my creation. My daughter, 15, sister, friend, dare 14, I say it, beloved. 13. That's pretty weird. 12. That is 11, weird. 10, 9, 8, 7. Oh, what? That's six, cheating. 5, 4, 3, 3 and 3 quarters. All right. 3 and a half. Deep three breath. And three, eighths, 3 and a quarter. 3 and 3 sixteenths. 3 and 1. Look, I'm a bomb, for heaven's sake. I'm bending over backwards to be fair and reasonable, but at the end of the day, I'm a bomb. And what bombs do, not to put too fine a point of it, is they blow up. Look, do you think I want to blow up? Do you think I enjoy the prospect of smearing myself all over half a parsec of space? Well, I don't, frankly. But we were all called upon to do things that we don't like from time to time, and you are making it very difficult for me. Recommencing countdown. Now, 1,999. Aw, that's disappointing. 998. <laughs> 997. Oh, it's an adventure game, Mike. 96. I am betting that the wires are the bomb. That the wires are the bomb? What? The, uh... The wires, the the wire sculpture. Oh, you think so? You think? Hold on, that would suggest that the bomb is supposed to be here. That the bomb is an integral part of the ship. That has not, to this point, been my assumption. Well, I thought we were looking at a, a fairly straightforward sabotage narrative. Wait, did, when you looked at the bomb, did uh, the dials? The dials were all red. So, okay. no, not the bomb. Well, how many bots are there? So, right, we know, um... We see the statues of Fentable and... Uh... Well, I think I know who this is. Yeah. Uh, so Fentable, Marcinta, and Craig. A uh, uh, one that we think is Nobby. And then... That's it, right? And then this weird one. And we know that there's, at, at the very least, there's also the barman and the Mater D bot. I guess maybe not all of them are represented here? Yeah, that's uh, distinctly possible. Who knows what's up with the, with the barman? We gotta get him out of that loop before he's gonna be any good to us. Alright. So, what information have I gotten now? Uh, let's maybe... Is is Navi still in agony? Well, we know we're not in a tremendous amount of danger from the bomb. Whatever. Sir, I don't suppose you were ever a military man? Military woman thing? Nah, silly of me. Let's keep it simple. I goes up, I goes down. Which is it to be? Oh, well, there you are, then. All right, fine. And he's not complaining about his injuries. Uh... 
often ask myself the same thing. <laughs> Don't see no point in that line of questioning. Hmm. Other direction, sir. What other direction? Need to know, though, since that's up. Uh, I need to know. <laughs> Not with you. Alright. Okay. Well, I need that long stick. Desperately. Yeah. Sure, sure. Um, so then we need probably... I mean, it seems to be the hammer, right? Yeah. I'll go... Oh, wait, no. First I want to go to the uh, parrot room. Do we? Yes. Let me check out... Oh, I suppose the parrot's not in there. Everything's fine. Yeah. I think it was was it channel two that had uh Our pollen levels are very low now. That's cloudy. Okay. Still doesn't mean anything to me. Well, I mean, have we tried rubbing our inventory all over that? Uh, not the whole inventory. Not interested in the chicken. How important? How important can it be if it's not interested in the chicken? One wonders. I'm gonna wipe. Uh, just wipe it off. Just rub some grease all over it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So. Pollen levels are as low as pollen levels can be. What is the, uh... What is the thing that we're doing that requires the pollen levels to be different? Um... There was some question about whether uh, it would improve mother's uh, allergies sound and stuff. Ah, yes, yes. Hmm. Build room. I suppose the wires could also be the succubus. Oh, that's true. You suck. I suck. No. He want blow, I blow. You want intellectual. D no. Pollen? It's truly awful. Um. Oh no! Not. Improved. I'm starting to think that, uh. Yeah, I'm starting to think that talking to her may not be useful. Yeah. Where? Yeah, good question. Uh, where where did I send it? Stop fiddling with me! Don't bother me! Stop oh fiddling boy, I have no idea. Me. Okay, well, I lost the parrot. <laughs> That's maybe fine. I'm fine with it.
Station lobby. All right. Let's um. Doorbot needed urgently. Unknown guest. It's pleasure unbridled to be here at your service. Unknown guest. Interesting. He's got memory issues. I I think let's just be that. Never heard of him. Or is it Bobby? Bobby. Uh, uh... It's interesting that most of the bots don't seem to have any idea who that is, considering he's on board. Yeah. Hmm. Well, so let's, uh... I'm not sure. Let's, uh, let's pick a goal and head in a direction. <laughs> That's a good way to go because about it. Because of the reason. <laughs> oh. Uh, what is the reason? Sorry, can't remember. That's supremely unhelpful. All right, I'm stick sorry. time. Do I know you? Huh. I think we need that sh that hammer, right? It's got to be. Yeah. I I want a hammer. All of my problems right now are nails. And when is it not true? Okay, so let's let's just Let's just see if we can't get ourselves a hammer. All right. No looking we have a lot of bits in our inventory. Days. So what we have, we have a stick, we have some arms, we have, I guess nothing else in our inventory is very long. No. Mind how you go. That's an order. How long? Yeah, I would. I would do. Um, like let's give it. Let's give it. Some, let's give it a, a good jabbing. I, we must need it to get. Uh... Oh. So nothing else makes the noise. Oh. What? What did you do different? I have no idea. Huh. Okay. Well, that's a, that is a very grandiose container for what appears to be a normal hammer. Alright. Well, hey, look at that progress. You remember progress? Yeah, but I don't feel like I did anything different to deserve this particular progress. <laughs> yeah, I'm not I'm not 100% sure what occurred there. Well, at least we can sort of mechanically Well, this, this is a little different, wasn't it? Maybe not. Oh, yeah. The top of no, the that's... well. Oh, cuz I'm facing the other way. Mind the door. Oh. I turned around before I operated facing, the Pellerator. Have we, have we been facing the back of the Pellerator while operating it this entire time? Yes. Uh, this is Elevator 1. Oh. Yeah, just jump. That'll be fine. We can add one smashed passenger to the, uh, to the Titanic titillator. Look, I don't have any TVs. All I can offer is my life. Well, the ship's got plenty of TVs. Maybe they have some smash TVs in, like, maintenance? Yeah, I wish I knew where that was. 
Morning, sir. I was just thinking about the first time you come into my lift. Nobby, I thought at the time. Here's someone in your lift. Because one thing the army does, it trains you to notice things. Uh, what else have you noticed? <laughs> you what? Okay. Doesn't teach you conversation skills. Uh... No sooner said than done, in a manner of speaking. That's not really what they need from you. The visual flaws, 14? Huh? Right, it's 14? No. Well, what is 14? It's 30, room 12. Yep. I did all of that wrong. <laughs> well, yeah, the STT classes, uh, classrooms are on the higher numbers, right? Because they're lower down in the ship. <laughs> The first class passengers have to be literally above the others. Maybe it's very important. Us, huh? Yeah, don't be ridiculous. You can't hit glass with a hammer from two feet away. You're right up on it. Wait, did I? Oh, hey. More sticks. <laughs> well, it's worth a shot. Did the message? Yes. You know, but I only have Don't... their word for it. <laughs> well, we got our long stick. Look at that. So. Cool. Yep. We have okay. A normal stick and then a good, a good long stick. All right. All right. So that gets us. Whatever that red thing was, and also Join some lemons. Whatever that what thing was? The that red thing, the red bit hanging from that vine. Oh yeah, we might stick it. Um, let's go to one. Top of the well. Sometimes when you speak to them, they make that noise, and I had thought that that noise might be a uh, an error sound, because it seemed to happen to Craig and Fentable. When you said something and then they were the well, supremely here, unuseful in response. But it just played there when he understood you, so I guess not. Maybe it's just random. Arg. Is this the right way? No. No, no, no. It's on the side with the, uh, the same side as the lobby. Oh, but I don't... I, it's unlikely or I you can, can just get there. Right. Yeah, let's, um... Let's pellerate. Now we're gonna face the front every time. <laughs> to see no if it's any different. Remarks, please. Apparently Leovinus designed the the robots, like the system that makes these robots work. The genuine people personality bots. No stupid grinning. Some please. Sort of some sort of genius. The Arboretum. This is uh, very Goodbye. far away. Doesn't seem like it should be, and given that we've we've traversed all the space between well, where we were and where we are. All right. So we want to stick this. What? Oh. Hmm. Is that... Oh dear. Okay. Oh. Huh. Well, that's oh. probably handy. Alright. I don't... I, I kind of feel like I should give her that back. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should have it be spring, so there are lots of allergens. Is the stick long enough to... Well, there's... I mean, I guess we try to prod the closer lemons, the ones that look larger. It looks like you actually hold this... 
stick by the middle? Yeah, so, I'm not good at sticks. This 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 lemon sort of um like right up front. Sort of in the middle, just to the right of yeah, I think that's the close one. You get lemon. He just if you just click on the lemon, does it give you an indication that it's No, it doesn't seem interactable. To. Can I hammer huh. a lemon off? <laughs> I think I, I'm pretty. Listen, listen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come right out. Let's dispense with the mystery. I'm pretty sure this is right. I'm pretty sure you do just long stick poke this big lemon in the middle here. Are you gonna try to try to hit it with just like the tip of the? Maybe the hitbox is like really particular. You're just singing still. No, well, that's not helping. Okay, I've got, a, I've got an idea. Go back to summer. And then take the stick in your hands and just swing it about wildly. Really, really let the trees have it. No reason to be gentle. Trees don't have feelings. I'm assuming. Oh, hey! I'm a genius. This is a nice, fat, juicy lemon. Can I... It is quite large. Okay, so... What did we need? We needed lemons and a flock of pureed starlings and a Crush TV set. I don't... No, do I have you a did... good way of getting... Because I have the Starling Puree coming out of the food dispenser. Yeah, you just need a way of carrying it. A receptacle. It's... I've seen a lot of bowls. In this... I mean, there are glasses in the bar. Yeah, maybe I can pick one of those up. And then it's really just a matter of smashing a TV or finding a TV that's already smashed, or there might be a maintenance room or something that that like Craig can get you a TV from. That's true. Can I get a broken TV? <laughs> Dear Craig. I know that we haven't been on the friendliest terms. But I really would wish for you to hand me a television. Uh, Do you happen to have any spare TVs? There's a TV right there. Why, there's TVs TV. all over the place. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. There's one in my... Um... Where yeah, did there's I... one presumably in each of the uh, second and first class rooms. There's no one on the other side of the room. By the succubus. Yeah, what? Can I? There's nothing here. You must have said not here. Maybe I lost it. Well, I think the parrot might be a lost cause. I bet the parrot will be in the build room if we go back to Mother. Bellbot needed urgently. And frankly, I don't Yo, care for it. Surf's up. What? <laughs> Why is he a so? surfer? <laughs> Are you sure? There actually is an article in this Inflight magazine written by him about worse surfing. And worse, don't they? You know the room with the parrot? Well, there's some odd stuff going on in there, you know. I I agree with you. Is he just like offering information now? What? Huh? Did you upset him? Wait, go. Did he go and? He just volunteered information about the parrot room. That was pretty strange. Bellbot needed urgently. Hey, did you find that thing you were looking for? Cool. How are you? Not sure. Oh yeah. 
Yeah, well, I guess what you don't know can't upset you. <laughs> you know something? I don't care anymore. I'm supposed to, but I don't. Okay. Uh... What do I care? There's nothing in it for me answering all your questions. Ow. What about... What about a t tip him? Offer to tip him for a broken television, maybe. I bet this would be crushed to a pulp if I threw it from the top of the well. Uh -huh. Give it to me. Give me, give me, give me. You never heard of please? Please give it to me. It's no use sucking up to me. I'm a free spirit, and I kowtow to no one. <laughs> That's cool. Um, so wait. What was that about the if throwing it from you, the top of the well? I pack it in and go to bed. Yeah, if you... I bet this would I be crushed would be to crushed a pulp, pulp if I threw it from the top of the well. But, but there's throw no... Throw it from the top of the well. Throw what from the top so of the I well? Just, I don't it. know, he said this, so I just say, just say throw it to... Maybe? Listen, I'm trying to encourage him to break stuff. Here, let's... Let's, uh... Let's go to the top of the well. I mean, we're at the top of the well. I mean, let's go to the... Can we, like, get closer? Oh, get that's real right. Close? In between... Let's go here. Bellbot needed urgently. Well, you are right hey, up against that rail. What's cooking? Throw, throw stuff me. from the top of the well. This may take a while to fix. Want to talk about something else? Break everything. Yeah, spare TVs. <laughs> I've got a strange urge to throw a TV down the well. I bet it'd make a radical sound. Yeah. Do it. Absolutely. Throw, do it. Got an input problem here. Give me that again, throw, can you? Throw it. Just tell him to throw a TV down the well. <laughs> what is this? A rock tour? You know the room with the parrot? Well, there's some odd stuff Damn. going on in there, you know. I feel like we're really close to this here. What? Well, <laughs> see what odd stuff, and he just bails. He does. He does. So, he's he's being super weird right now, though, right? Yes. This whole ship has gotten very strange. It was strange when we got on board, but I think it's stranger now. And I'm no longer afraid of the bomb, but I am afraid that Leavenus might jump out from behind a corner and beat me to death. Alright, so I need to get a television. Well, there's one in the parrot room, and also Craig seems to have a weird, all of a sudden, obsession with the parrot room. Yeah. We also need to figure out um, how to... Uh, that's not what I want. Go back. Huh, weird. Alright, Craig. Also, for some reason, it seems that we care about the perch that's in the bird's cage, but I don't know where you have a perch. This television has uh, has been more useful. Oh yes, this is still. Well, let's oh. let's call Craig up and see if we can't talk him into smashing this TV. He he seems to want to. Even greetings. We can do this. <laughs> we yeah. can convince a yeah. robot. Smash the ship! Smash the ship! Smash the ship! Bellbots are bad. That was remarkably easy. Wait, where? <laughs> okay. And I walked back here. That's strange. 
Oh well, no, you were still here. That the thing we the thing that just happened. We didn't right. this. Did a new TV thing. come? Maybe. Maybe there were two TVs down there. Okay. Um, <laughs> Maybe he smashed a TV that's always been just out of view. 